Here we go. Base is loaded. Bottom of the eighth. Two down. Tie game. Montero drives one in the air. Deep right field. It's got a chance. Grand slam. Grand slam. Look out, Montero. Wrigley Field is shaking right now after the blast of Montero. Unbelievable. I'm Darwin Zook with the MLB.com Fastcast. With game one of the NLCS tied at three in the eighth, Miguel Montero's pinch hit grand slam set Wrigley Field on fire as the Cubs outlasted the Dodgers eight to four. It was the third pinch hit grand slam in postseason history, and Dexter Fowler added a solo blast to make it back to back jacks as the Cubs took a 1-0 series lead. In the second inning, Javier Baez became the first Cub to steal home in the postseason since 1907, a year in which the Cubs won the World Series. The two teams tangle in game two on Sunday, Clayton Kershaw taking on Kyle Hendricks at Wrigley. Ball game, and the Indians have won again. They have held this Blue Jay attack to one run in 18 innings of baseball. And the Indians pitching staff has struck out 25 Blue Jays in the first two ball games. The Indians, meanwhile, continue to pitch lights out in the ALCS against the Blue Jays. Josh Tomlin had the curveball working early, and Andrew Miller came out firing from the bullpen again, tossing two scoreless innings, striking out five. Cleveland wins game two, two to one, and takes a 2-0 series lead. Carlos Santana hit his first career postseason homer to power the offense. The scene shifts to Toronto for game three on Monday. Trevor Bauer on the hill, opposed by Marcus Stroman. For more on these stories and for complete coverage of the 2016 postseason, keep it locked to MLB.com. It's baseball everywhere.